the Old Blue Last, nestled on the corner of Great Eastern Street and Curtin Road in London. This historic watering hole, it's had many lives. It was once a brothel, but before that, it had been a bar for over 300 years. Rumor has it that even Shakespeare was a regular back in the day. The last was originally named after a cobbler's tool, but it later became the old blue last and survived the Victorian era as a working-class pub. Eventually, it transformed into a notorious bar and brothel in the 20th century, earning a reputation as one of the hottest spots in Shoreditch. Despite its scandalous past, the old blue last takes pride in its raffish history. Built in 1700 on the site of James Burbage's The Theatre, the first purpose-built theater in Britain since the Roman era, this pub has seen it all. The theater was later dismantled and rebuilt across the river as the Globe in what was arguably the world's most spectacular attempt to avoid paying rent. In 1876, Truman's Brewery took over the pub and demolished it. But they soon rebuilt it as the Old Blue Last, with a name deriving from the Old Blue wooden pattern used to mold shoes. In the late 19th century, gents came here to eat, and ladies sipped tea while wearing their finest caps and well-made shoes. It was a time before Guy Ritchie and Pete Doherty, and everyone called each other Squire in a non-annoying way. Remarkably, a massive mirror hanging in the main bar has survived all the way from this era. It's a testament to the pub's enduring legacy. To get there, take the overground and get off at Shoreditch High Street. Then take a six-minute walk to reach the pub. Once you arrive, you'll find that the Old Blue Last is more than just a place to drink. It's a cultural institution that celebrates music and art. The pub's live music performances have earned it a legendary reputation, with many famous bands and DJs stopping by for secret gigs along the way. Step inside, and you'll be greeted by the smells of wood and leather, mingling with the scents of beer and pub grub. The sound of clinking glasses and chatter fills the air, punctuated by the occasional burst of laughter. The dimly lit interior is cozy and intimate, with wooden beams and exposed brick walls that tell the story of the pub's long history. As you order a pint, you'll notice the eclectic mix of patrons, a hip young crowd that's come to soak up the pub's lively atmosphere. On the weekends, the place is packed with the buzz of excitement building as the night wears on. It's the perfect spot to catch up with friends or listen to new music while sipping on a cold pint. The Old Blue Last is a London institution that stood the test of time. Despite its scaleless past, it remains a place of community, creativity, and celebration. Come for the history, but stay for the music, and leave with memories that will last a lifetime. These are Interesting Things with J.C.